Before I begin, I just have to say that I deserve the credit for my sister Isabella's marriage to John Knightley. They have known each other for ages, but I'm the one that planted ideas in their mind of matrimony. Secondly, I do deserve the credit for the match between Miss Taylor, my governess, and Mr. Weston. Mr. Knightley, well, John Knightley's brother, George, doesn't approve of my matchmaking. He says it's meddlesome and gossipy, but I can't help it. Now I have a new protege, Harriet Smith. She's a girl of lower status than myself, but we're coming along nicely. I'm looking um, at matches for her as well. Just the other day, though, she told me she was quite in love with Mr. Robert Martin, who happens to be a farmer. A detestable, a commoner. You'd think she'd at least fall in love with someone of higher status than herself, a gentleman, who can inherit some money without having to work for it. But no, Mr. Robert Martin, a farmer. Oh, Harriet. <sighs> I must compose myself. It was very shocking when she told me. Very shocking, indeed. However, I have picked out for her a different match, a Mr. Elton. He's planning on going into the ministry. He's quite handsome and has a considerable income. I think he'll be perfect for Harriet. Doesn't approve of my matchmaking. He says it's meddlesome and gossipy. But I can't help it. It's so fun! He says it's meddlesome and gossipy and that I belong with a bunch of old ladies, which is injurious to my conscience. <laughs> <laughs> Which is injurious to me. 